My guest is attorney Jim Monroe. He's a bankruptcy attorney, now been certified as a bankruptcy attorney for 20 years. Congratulations, Jim. Well, thank you, Tom. Yeah. Hey, Jim, I want to talk about student debt, and we know that there's a ton of it out there these days. We've already talked a little bit about when it can be wiped out, but there's a something new in place about if you got a diploma or you're getting a diploma from a school that fails, that may help you wipe out student debt. Yes, uh, that's been one of the ways that you could discharge your student debt if you are in a uh, for-profit school or uh, a school that closes or closes within a certain number of days after you've received your diploma. But now there's been a ruling, I believe, by the Department of Education that if you went to one of the Corinthian schools here in Florida, that's Everest, um, that has closed no matter when you receive your degree, if you can show that they somehow defrauded you by inducing you to get an education that uh, where your degree was pretty much worthless, you can discharge that student loan. I'm not completely familiar with Everest schools, but is that a place that you would get a four-year degree from? Yes, it's a for-profit school. And these for-profit schools were really um, came about because of student loans. They have you go out and get student loans, and uh, that fuels the profit nature of the school. And sometimes, uh, I'm not saying that all for-profit schools are bad, but they they tend to have less than um, uh, a very high percentage of people that graduate. And uh, the default rate, uh, because of the for-profit schools, is higher among for-profit schools than, let's say, a public university. So the school we're talking about is Everest University. If you got a degree from Everest University, no matter how long ago, it is now available to you to wipe out through bankruptcy. Well, not bankruptcy. uh, These are uh, uh, not bankruptcy, but um, this is actually through the Department of Education. Okay. Okay. So if it is a, a loan that is um, a federally backed or uh, a, you know, loan made by the Department of Education for um, one of these for-profit schools, Everett specifically, uh, you may be able to argue that they defer- somehow defrauded you by hyping the value of the education or inducing you to come to their school.